Good afternoon, Knock Lock on a motorbike. Another ride out this afternoon. This time I started in Derbyshire, down in a place called Glossop. Uh, I'm just going to film my ride home. So we're going to go out of Glossop, which we've just done, coming up here, over to our side, 6 to 8 Woodhead, and then going to go left then and up over Home Moss, down through Home Firth. And then I'll make it up after that. So it's a little bit unusual coming this way. I usually go the opposite direction, so it'll be quite nice actually seeing the uh, vistas open up. Let's go the wrong way around, really, for what I normally do it. get the first uh, bit of the view as we go around this bend look at that valley this runs around now into Devil's Elbow I thought she was going to cut that corner. water in that than there was uh, the last time I came round but then again we have had quite a bit of rain still not full though but it will fill up over winter no doubt
there is considerably more water in there than there was last time I was down here right, this is a, a challenge now getting out of top of here again it might not be a challenge that is very unusual especially for this time of day <coughs> got the uh, regulation white car so the white van and a white car every single time you do this but stuck to me back end like a limpet pressuring to go faster well he's one of them it's not happening they're going to take the home Firth road is just round here behind me, it's probably going to take me out so he sees the view I don't blame him either go for it mate go on, it's all yours long drag of a climb up to the top of home moss Any more nice days like this we'll get before winter sets in and then we've got to look forward to next year so we have a, another lovely summer next year maybe not quite as hot but still nice and dry plenty of days to get out on the bike then
uh, home Moss Radio Tower where all your BBC channels come from on your radios look at that view oh my god that's good wow what a view that's another one I never get tired of just in this car park at the right hand side here on a weekend there's usually a a tea bar, a little uh, ice cream van that sells teas and coffees as well. And you usually get on the Sunday, you get a load of old guys, or oldish guys, turning up with the uh, British bikes. And it's quite nice just going up there, sitting down, and talking a complete load of rubbish about bikes. We were up there a few weeks ago. There were a bloke there and he had a, an aerial 350 Red Hunter 350cc single cylinder with the two separate sprung seats just the same sort of bike as my dad had only my dad's had a sidecar on double adult sidecar oh, it was absolutely fantastic to see the bike like that if ever I come into some money that's, uh, that's what I'm having that I'll not replace this little baby it's got that lovely burble out of exhaust as we go down here on overrun Lane Village. I always wonder what they call this little piece. It's called Lane. to home so we've got home moss is the hill this is home and then we've got home firth which is at the bottom and there's a little cobble street there
again using engine braking Bridge. I've been through these loads of times, probably hundreds of times, never really taken any notice of what the different names were. Thought you were going to walk then. So we're dropping down now into Old Firth. If you've ever watched um, Last of the Summer Wine, this is where it was filmed. Just round here, in one of the squares, is where Sid's calf was. So just up the right hand side there, side of that uh, church, there was Sid's calf in the corner. out now up towards Wakefield and I'll make my way back home so I'm just about back now so I'm going to sign out so I hope you've enjoyed it if you have please consider uh, subscribing if you've already subscribed, thank you. It does mean a lot. Very much appreciated. Hit the uh, notification bell so that you'll get notified when I put another one up. And give it a like and share. So ride safe. And I might see you out on the road one day.